So this, it says it's just sold and the asking price, 100,000. <laughs> that is a nice looking Camaro though. Whoo, 100,000. Hello everybody. I'm Emily. And I'm Jerry. And today we are back at Streetside Classics here in Concord, North Carolina. They have got the coolest cars. Like that, a huge range from like new and modern to old and classic. It is what's up. And it's a sales and consignment place. So we're going to go inside. We've done a video on this place before, but almost two years ago. So it's a little update video on what they got inside. Classics is awesome. There are so many just cool, look, like look at this right here. Cool and amazing vehicles. This is, I've said this in every video I've made of, that we've done on vehicle or cars. This is my dream car. This is so, such a beautiful car. Look at the screaming eagle on the hood. Oh my God. Oh, look at the seats. That is awesome. Look at this. Love it. Sixty-five thousand for a sixty-eight Chevy Camaro SS. So here's a 1970 Chevy pickup truck and we were just talking. And I feel like if I got in it and it didn't smell like gas and like cigarettes, I would be really, <laughs> just, and like some sawdust from a furniture factory. Like I would just be, those are like nostalgic childhood memories. Oh and yeah. I feel like that's what this needs to smell like on the inside. <laughs> you know, I, I love classic and sport, classic cars and sports cars. I, w I would definitely love to have an old pickup truck like this just to be running around in. How sweet would that be? see what the inside looks like here so the asking price on this is 40,000 in a brand new truck you know a 2022 year I mean you're 50 60 thousand I would I would pick this over a brand new one any day of the week love it so what do you think the price is on this 67 well let's take a look and five dollars under a hundred thousand how much do you think this Chevy truck they're asking for right under 58,000 a 1950 Chevrolet 3100 resto mod uh, I got a cup holders right there Beautiful wood paneling in the truck bed. I'd be scared to literal dead. There's not enough insurance in the world to pay me to park <laughs> one of these cars. They are they are packed in pretty tight right now. I'm scared of going through it with the stroller. Like I'm terrified to get up on the car. <laughs> and this stingray. Sweet. Oh, they're really sweet. It's like we got like almost an original Ford Bronco. A lot cheaper than what they're trying to sell the new ones for. 1972 Ford Bronco. Plenty of room. There's a lot of room. Not too many thrills. 
Basic, but I can drive it, so I'm six to you. There we go. It looks like with this one, they put like a clear coat over the rust and the patina on it. I've seen a couple things done like this before. Pretty interesting. What, what do you all think? Would you like something like this where the rust and the patina is preserved? So they're asking 33,000 for this 65 Mustang. We paid more than that for our minivan. <laughs> I might want to trade that in for this. I'll groceries in this. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. I don't know about cars. Cars, uh, I don't know. There's a big back seat in there. There's only two doors, but. There's seat belts back there. Yeah, we're good. Okay, now. Throw Evelyn in the back. Should be riding in for fun. So this is a 1952 International. We're asking, I think that sticker says 40, 44,000. Just a really cool truck. I've seen a few car shows where they've kind of, they've been trying to find these out in the wild. And to see one of these in the condition this is in, just impressive. It's a big, big vehicle. I'm 6'6", six, six, and it is way taller than I am. Love it. Not only, not only do they have one of the Bandit Trans Ams, but they got two of them. Look at that. expanded from the last time we've been here a whole new wow this just never ends so this was another one i've been looking for so i my very first car was a 92 gt fox body this one's probably my guess would be the more to mid to late 80s still what a car one day i'm getting my mustang back The inside looks almost exactly the same. The interior on this one, that chrome is popping. I'm not sure what to think of the completely blacked out old school truck here. I mean, I'm all about cars being blacked out not sure if I like it. Or, yeah, it does. <laughs> Thirty-five thousand. That that is tempting. Love the color too. That is sweet. Yeah, this black and white Camaro. Wow. So Streetside Classics here in uh, Concord, North Carolina, right outside of Charlotte. If you love cars. Yes, if you even remotely love cars. Like this, this place is this, for you. This place is a must stop. So if you're in the area visiting, or if you live here and you just don't know about it. And it's free. It's free. And you can come check it all out. From classic cars, to sports cars, to new, uh, fancy new cars. cars. Like It's got it all. It's got it all. So come check out Street, Street Side, Side Classics. Classics here in Concord, North Carolina. Bye y'all.